Welcome to Prayer and Coffee. In Matthew 13, Jesus said, Behold, a sower went out to sow. And he said, Some fell on hard ground, some among stony places, and some fell among thorns. But others fell on good ground and yielded a crop, some a hundredfold, some sixty, some thirty. He who has ears to hear, let him hear. In Revelation 2 and 3, Jesus says repeatedly, He that hath an ear has an ear to hear. Let him hear what the Spirit is saying to the churches. Prayer was dying out among many in our churches, but there has been a fresh wind blowing from Holy Spirit, a fresh wind that has revived hearts, resurrected dead dreams, a fresh wind of the Spirit that has stirred up gifts and raised up a powerful praying army that will usher in healings and signs and wonders through the church and into our communities once again. Holy Spirit has called and prepared a remnant of prayer warriors who know how to use the Word of God in prayer for such a time as this, a time when God is releasing vision, faith, and a greater measure of grace for turning the tide of complacency in His people, a time of bringing prodigals back to Father's house, a time of seeing a new, perhaps final, harvest just before Jesus returns. Let's pray. Father, we honor you today, and we pray your will be done on earth as it is in heaven. I thank you that Holy Spirit is fanning the embers into a brightly burning blaze of passion for prayer once again, burning brightly, Lord, in my heart, and let the flames burn brightly in the hearts of the body of Christ at Community Haven. Lord, pour out your last day portion of Holy Spirit on Community Haven, on your remnant church in America, on the body of Christ in Romania, and on your faithful remnant of believers around the world. Revive our hearts. Rebirth our dreams. Bring us into the purpose you planned for your church for this generation. Father, let your word be confirmed with healings and signs and wonders once again. In Jesus' name, amen.